Ever was a Bhakti. Yes, I am the privilege to have. Ever was a Bhakti. This is a very special day. This is Dr. Sarpali Radha Krishna on his one of his birthdays. Inspired the whole the students' community that his birthday is better be in the form of a tribute to a teacher and to the teaching, teaching community. Dr. Sarpali Radha Krishna was born on 5th September 1888. In a town near Madras, now be Christian and Chennai. And this was the spirit behind when people approached him to celebrate, to offer a bouquet of flowers, he said, Let my community be honored. And he had such an immense sense of belonging to the community of teachers. He said, Let the whole teaching community get honored on this day and let 5th of September be celebrated as the Teacher's Day. So ever since that time, we have been honoring teachers and I think students who are, who are not participating because of uh, paucity of space uh, are somewhere that I think they are, they, are, they are somewhat to lose out on something very, very substantial. Because the very element of it, it's these students, the core, the core of it is the students, because students who come forward to celebrate the teacher's day are as their spirit, as their enthusiasm, as their zeal to come forward, that they come forward and each one of them at least bring one butter flower and present it to his or her teacher. I think that should have been a model way of celebrating it today. But then I think on behalf of all of you, I take this privilege to present a bouquet of flowers to our director, Vanchula Bhatra, on behalf of all of you. Sheets can be are duly audited 
are transparent, can be audited by anybody. Anyone can come and check the accounts of the Strength India Education Society as well as that of Vivekananda Education Society. We are just trying to survive on certain principles, on certain ethos, and for that work culture and ethos, it is we who to come forward here. I extend to you all my teachers, and I want to make a few announcements here on this uh, teacher's day. Uh, Mr. Ravindran has been adjudged to be the best teacher in constitutional law. <laughs> and uh, the cash prize of his 2000 from my salary goes to him. <laughs> Similarly, in absentia, Professor Amrish Saxena, who has acted in a small documentary on Munshi Premcha, he has left the BTFC stream by the Frankfurt and he is now heading the media center as a consultant at the IT University. So, another cash prize of rupees 2000 goes for him as the best speaker in the journey of last year in the stream. On the IT stream, Dr. Sushila Madan, we have done her doctoral thesis on the uh, network security, but then uh, the best teacher's award goes to Mr. Saurav Shukla in his absentia. He is not here. He has done his attack and still pursuing our study, but he was one of the best teachers on the IT side. So, also the law, law I have already announced, Jalyukam I have already announced, and other all round best teacher's award goes to Mr. Tara Chetta. you know, I mean, behind every judge, you see, I mean, most of them carry their gowns, 
So it used to be some kind of charity given to a person who used to dispense justice earlier. But now that's not the case. So there's a bigger, you know, couch. And the senior the lawyer, the bigger the couch. And, and, and there's no question of charity. Use some of fees asked for, for every sitting and for every hearing. So, and for every brief, uh, briefing, rather, if you have to bring some advocate, he will give you something like that. So, this legal profession is becoming very expensive. Like my, my profession, it used to be a very, very human profession. And when we used to defend justice in villages, it never used to cost anything. But now the type of justice being dispensed in villages also is something <laughs> I mean, uh, I'll keep you a lot, I may say, I mean, it doesn't really speak of the time that we are living in. So on this teacher's day, I'm reminded of those three myths. The first is misunderstanding. The second is misinterpretation. The third is misuse. When you have a great presidency attitude, you're trying to exploit a smaller nation, mighty nation, wealthier nation. It's not my words. They come straight from the most Revered person in the history, and if it comes straight from there, from the horse's mouth, so then what we need to do is to promote understanding, to remove any scope for misinterpreting each other's intentions or whatever may be my ideas. Please don't misinterpret it. Try to understand them in the right perspective, and let's not try to abuse or misuse somebody's freedom or liberty or. Uh, it is too lenient. Now I know the time constraint uh, that Professor Vasantha who is facing, and he says these politicians they are they only know lecturing, <laughs> and they, they, are, they are no almost no essence of substance in their in their talk. I would end on this note that let's promote harmony, let's promote understanding, let's try to interpret things in the right perspective, let's stop abuse of all kinds, exploitation of all sorts and today the most I'm really overwhelmed because because the, the, the manner that my teachers have conducted themselves the last couple of years, I see all creativity manifesting itself through them in one form or the other. Even for each one of them when I get the students feedback, there's a feedback form here, which has now been very quietly received by the management. Maybe you are not aware of it. But based on the students' feedback, we get to know that the greater involvement of teachers now, there's a sense of belonging, there's a, sense, there's a record that has been developed fully now by our teachers in between them. Now, 20,000 rupees cash award also goes to the IT stream for having got the highest placement in Wipro and IT. <laughs> For the last three consecutive years, it has stopped in the university. Our students have stopped in the university. The president of the I think, from the chairman's committee, not from the Vidya Kalda Institute of Political Studies, has maintained this integrity. And the fight of the for having had the best mood for competitions anywhere here and where maximum number of sitting judges from the Supreme Court, the High Court, have participated so another five thousand rupees to the law stream, IT stream for their placement, BDF stream for having the top in the university in the top of the top the last and the five thousand rupees for the for the best food 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 competition that have been held under the leadership of Manjula Bhutra and Dr. Sushira Vada and just now joined. She is going to teach you what uh, how, how you can secure your network and how do digital signatures work now. And she is one of those, she is from Rishram College, and we have part of the great deal of difficulty. It's very difficult to deal with that many people like Walton, Professor Walton Tami. If I want somebody on deposition, I'm sure he's going to raise 10 queries, like a few bureaucrat, uh, our friend Shri Asar Sharma. But let me just tell you, ladies and gentlemen, and dear students, you are going to be the future citizens of this nation, that right conduct, sense of responsibility, and sense of duty. So right conduct, sense of duty, and sense of responsibility must be cast upon you. You must behave yourself, conduct yourself in the most ideal manner, in the most ideal manner. 
I tell we are all are mostly when they are learning what to work and to work up. So I refuse to thank Sri Asar Sharma because he is a very kind hearted person. He has a very tough experience. As in when he was he used to be the home secretary or the chief secretary of the state, his portion used to be very tough. But behind this tough experience has been a very kind heart which he threw open the bars even when the politicians were ever to he is secretary talking straight to the people, having public grievances. So he had public grievances forums. He opened up himself with the office of the chief secretary rather than sitting in a cozy room. So many people, many parliamentarians did like his exposure to the public. But then in spite of all that, in spite of that, and despite of that, he has been a tremendous success both in civil service as well as in academics. So I pay my tributes to him and my close thanks to him as well as Professor Wilson Tampu. I think Professor Wilson Tampu's presence here goes a long way because I have been waiting to hear him for a pretty long time. I don't know some different opinions about being transcribed, but then uh, uh, Mr. Sharma and Mr. Wilson Tampu, I don't know what point it was. Then let me not uh, make any conjectures about it. But he, uh, Mr. Sharma has been so uh, he has been so much, you must go and meet that man, even much before he had taken over as the principal of Stevens College. Maybe he is clever attached to his post now, but even when he was not the principal, he said there is one person whom I recommend Dr. Webb, you go there, you will feel enriched. So, Professor Russell Tampo, thank you very much indeed for having uh, to give, give us the privilege of welcoming you. Thank you.